so I've attached this uh, log wizard um, debarker to my chainsaw. Bought it on on Amazon. I think it was a hundred and eighty eight dollars, I believe. But we're gonna have a ton of projects where we're stripping bark off uh, pine trees, and uh, I plan on building. Um, you know, our house build. We have to strip all the bark off these. I'm gonna build a garage with with. Uh, tamarack logs um, multiple woodsheds with tamarack logs so we have to peel all those um, those trees also so anyway this was kind of a pain to put on I thought it would have been um, a lot easier but the bar of a chainsaw is the hardest material known to man and uh, it wasn't easy drilling this I, I uh, wrecked three of my bits trying to go through do one hole and I didn't get get it through so I brought it to my uh, stepdad and he he's a machinist so he had the right stuff and uh, he put the other two holes in to finish it up so one thing I did learn from him was that you should uh, go slow with your drill bit and uh, push on it and I was going the fastest my drill would would run and uh, that actually just it like heats up the metal and hardens it even more so um, and then obviously use a good drill bit so I went and bought um, a little bit better drill bit anyway, a cobalt drill bit. They were about like almost $8 a piece. But uh, I had to drill another hole, and I'll explain that in a second, but that hole went good. I, I actually drilled right, right through it pretty much. So I use a little cutting oil too on it. Um, but what I did wrong was, was um, I didn't want this thing to be flimsy, so I put one screw tight here and one screw tight here. And, uh, and I wanted the adjustment for the chain just to be on the bar and the uh, chainsaw itself, the adjustment screw. But what I found was that's not enough adjustment. You do need to put a hole on one end of this slot and like this way, let's say, and then on this end of this slot also. That way you have that hole adjustment to play with on those ovals. And I thought I could get around that, but I couldn't. So I had to drill three holes all together uh, to get the adjustment, to, to get this chain to be the right tension. So I think I got it now and we're going to see if this thing works and, and make our first cut. Well, I'm not impressed. That's what I get for <laughs> trying to take a shortcut. I don't know, it does, it, it's like a planer. Um, you have to get the angle right on the saw, and then the, uh, this one's so large, 
uh, the radius that the chain is biting in and putting a deeper groove um, on this side as the the log lizard is cutting also so you get a deeper groove on that one side um, so I wouldn't suggest using this for a log that you want to peel and have exposed um, and you want the look of it you know what I mean because this is just gonna grind it and it's it's not gonna look natural natural obviously it's gonna look like a like a planer just went over it and uh, put a bunch of gouges and grooves in it and not only that this would take a ton of gas to finish this up I mean I've been at it for about five minutes now granted maybe there's a trick to it I don't know but to me just some a little sweat and hard work peeling it by with a floor scraper seems to go a lot quicker um, it looks nicer when I'm done and uh, it does a better job because there's a lot of spots where this is missing and I have to hit it again and stuff Maybe I gotta play with it a little bit more. Going side to side didn't work. Going down the the, the length of it worked better. But um, yeah, I, I don't like it for this. I could see how it would be good for uh, making like a saddle notch in a. In a log once you get used to it and get the feel for it you could uh smooth out um you know notch a log um but you'd have to be careful because it i mean it really takes off a lot of material so you really have to f uh, get good with it and be able to feather it but um for this i just don't think it's going to work for us which sucks because i'm guessing it's something you really can't take back so but hopefully it'll come in handy sometime so I'll have to give it some time. Maybe if I play with it a little bit more, I'll get better at it.